So we're here with Zach Dax Shepherd. and Michael. Michael Pena. That I know as a poncharelo. That's what poncharello. when I when I was a kid, that's what we call the, the, the Latino guy on the chips, right? Yeah. Poncharelo. Oh, yeah. How was it? How how was the, in, in your house? Um, it, it was it was kind of the same. Like him, Charles Bronson, and Clint Eastwood were like the main guys that my dad I was. You know, and especially because my dad was a boxer growing up, and you know he played soccer across the street, and you know come back all bruised and bloodied sometimes. He's like, yeah, let's go watch some cheese. <laughs> <laughs> now you guys now are being in LA for a long time now. I yeah, guess. 20, like, 20, over 20, twenty years. years yeah. yeah. So now you are highway patrol. That's right. That's right. That's scary, right? Mm -hmm. Have we been stopped before for a highway patrol? I've never been stopped by a highway patrolman because they're they're really I think that like as soon as you you see them you slow down and you're like. Or at least you check and make sure that you're not speeding, because I never speed. I've lost my license a half dozen times since I was 16. I've, I'm on the side of the road talking to them quite often. <laughs> so I feel like I had done a lot of research over the last 22 years. I've, I've, I've had the pleasure of meeting a few dozen of them. But it was all research. <laughs> it was all, as all it turns research. out, I should write off all those tickets yeah. now. Yeah, the art, the yeah, art yeah. up front. <laughs> now it is, what makes this movie, because coming from a TV show and then go to a movie is, People already have established that Eric Strada and, yeah. and the John. So how you know how the what did you actually did in that point to come up with uh, your own character? Oh yeah, I mean the thing is is like Eric Estrada, like he's just like a very charismatic guy. So like no matter what he did, he was gonna be a big star. You know if he was like doing Michelin commercials, like he would be the Michelin guy. He's like oh Eric Estrada is a Michelin guy, and he would just be cool. And he made it his own. So I, you know, I pretty much decided to make it my own as well, and I worked with Dax, you know, we, like, uh, rehearsed quite a bit, and, uh, you know, just, just one day at a time, man. One day at a time. Carved it out. Now, what's, what, what was the funniest part that you shot? Yeah, uh, I bet you some stuff that's cut that's really funny because he, he's got some, an interesting. Yeah, story. yeah, yeah. Well, what you find out when you if you write and direct a movie, you get to test how much of your own uh, sense of humor is broadly appealing, right? So I put every joke I think is funny, and, and then as I tested it, I found out about 20% of my sense of humor is way too perverted for America. So <laughs> there are many scenes that I found hilarious and that Michael thought were hilarious that were probably too perverted. I mean, the scene where I'm um, hugging the guy in the locker room, that, that's an old friend of mine. It's a very awkward scene for Ian and I to film, <laughs> and there, we're shooting between our packages onto Michael, and he's got to be in Enjoy. the moment, but we can't stop laughing because it's so <laughs> weird, and uh, we, yeah, we were driving him crazy. So that was. And funny. you were enjoying that, their faces, and you were concentrated. Well, it was How really... much I Stanislavski put you on that? Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, it was really funny to to to, to see Ryan because he was so he's like, oh man, dude, we again, we have to do it again, dude. <laughs> you remember right? And then I was kind of enjoying how uncomfortable he was. So yeah, uh, but yeah, it, what it was. It it wasn't that it was so difficult of an acting scene for Michael, but it was a difficult. Um, uh, technically, he had to, he had to look. There were a bunch of things happening in the scene, so he had to like look there, shake his head. Then he had to see another guy that was naked and really get freaked out, and then look over here. All while this is happening, so we had to time it. It was more technical than you would think. So we have to wrap up, but tell me in a funny way what these people have to go and watch this movie, mm. please. Um, well, I would just say if you ever were watching Chips and you thought, I want to see this movie uh, on steroids and hyperdrive, this is the movie for you. I mean, we go to the edge as far as what we could do. Yeah. Pocharello? Well, I think people are going to, you know, they're just going to enjoy it. I mean, we saw it yesterday with, uh, with an audience and, you know, they're, they're in on it. All just right. Just go watch the movie. Bam. Oh, yeah. well, thank you. Up and close for you guys. Go with Chips. Watch Chips. Watch it. Watch, Watch it. Chips. Or eat it. Watch it. March 24th. Whatever. March 24th. Just right. put it in.